Okay, it is nearly 3 in the morning, but I really want to try and solve the computer puzzle. Oh. Jake, let me know when you're back. Oh my gosh, I feel so bad every time I close down this game because like this girl is like relying on me. I'm back. I don't know why this keeps happening. Oh my gosh, this poor girl. So yes, my desktop background has changed. I don't know what to do. What's this pattern? Maybe if I explore a bit, I don't know. I'm sorry for not having the pattern up on screen. Maybe I should. Really? I'm seeing a lot of them in doorways and stuff. Yeah, fuck it, I'll show you guys. So here's like, here's a little pattern. I'll put that down here. This showed up on my desktop after I, um, after speaking to the computer. So, um, yeah, I'm trying to figure out how to solve the second puzzle. I mean, the, the desktop wallpaper got me something. Anyways, I just assumed it was because this place was abandoned. A sign of distress. Huh? A living being is in need of help, but I cannot trace the source. Ah. Maybe that's me they're talking about. Plus their vines are blocking the way. And sorry for the lag. I'm exporting the second part of this Let's Play series. Or at least I'm working on it. Oh? Hold on. I see that symbol on the wall. Or at least it, it closely resembles symbol I'm looking at. Hello person. Two children reside near here. What, are we just gonna ignore the fact that I have a computer terminal to solve? I mean, I don't know if I'm supposed to ignore it for now, or... Or what? S Savior? I can't believe it. You're real. Miss? Are you alright? No. We should get you to the village. Maybe they could... It's okay. It's okay. Too late for me. But the sun. I haven't seen it. I haven't felt it in so long. Savior, if it's not too much trouble, can you let me the sun for a while? I will it make you better? No, it will not save me. I just want to experience the sun one more time before I well Oh would it be too selfish of me to ask? What should I do, Jake? Give her the sun. Oh. Mm, dang, if only I had Andrew with me. Oh my gosh. Okay, so like, if I were Nico, I would give her the sun. But like, that's just because like me personally, like I put a lot of people before me like, especially, like, if they're in need. Well, I mean, okay. Well, online, if they're in need. Not so much in real life, but... I don't know. I know this game has, like, permanent consequences. Oh, my gosh. No, 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 no.
it's probably the wrong choice. Well, well wrong in a lot of people's opinions, but I'm gonna give her the son. You know, I mean, she, I mean, she hasn't seen her son in so long. You know. So. Okay, let's try it. Here. Warm. I have almost forgotten. It's so warm. That's good, right? The, the vine should be gone now. I'm not afraid anymore. Can I take the sun back? It's the sun. We're leaving it with her for now. Oh man. So I can't take it with me then. Okay. The only way back to go is into the cave. Maybe I should go back to the computer terminal. Oh, that's right, she said the vines would be gone. Oh, livestock. There's a person. Hey, uh, you here to trade? Trade? Yeah. Is there anything you want to get rid of? Make me an offer and I'll give you something in return. Hmm. Do we have something like that, Jake? Whoa. That's a lot of shiny things. Glass shards, glass marbles, empty glass bottles, mostly empty glass bottles, glass bottles filled with different things, bits of string, colored wool, plain wool, fabric, fabric scraps, a rusty bucket, Scrap metal shells, some rocks. Wow, what's all this for, by the way? I just think they're neat. Couple fireflies are buzzing about in this jar. This looks like an altar. A pair of shoes and some jewelry. A staff. Not only the one that that robot from the Baron just holding. Okay, so we gave that girl the sun for now. The flood can take away our farmlands, but it can't take away our fish. These look like herrings or anchovies, maybe sardines. I honestly have no clue. Okay, I feel like really insecure without the sun. But I mean, if we can make at least someone happy in this bitter, uh, ruined world, then, you know, that's good, I guess. Wow, there's a lot, a lot of livestock. Wait, whoops. Hello, we got some mage of sorts, maybe? Would you like to help me herd my rams? There's a great reward in store for you, I promise. Uh... Alright, let's do it. Excellent. To the south is a peninsula inhabited, inhabited by my rams. They are all standing in unfortunate spots. I need to move them onto the darker moss. If you get stuck, Ring a bell, and they'll all return to their original positions. Good luck. So what's to the south of here? What's over here? The crops have been growing poorly without the sun. There's no telling how long our surplus will last. Please, Savior, you have to hurry. I hate. I'll do my best. How does that chick know I'm the Savior?
I mean, I don't have the sun with me. I haven't met her yet. Coals. Looks like moss. I guess people would eat those. It's slowly being chipped away already, but still trying to stay alive, I think. Doesn't matter. One day the world, world will finally give up this fight. I just hope I'm not alive to see it. I'm bringing back the sun, though. That won't fix the root of the problem. Just like the other lady said. But don't lose heart. Without the sun, the world will die much faster. At the very least, I'm sure everyone would like to see the sun again. That's interesting. Wow. Your eyes glow in the dark. Yeah. Just like the sun. This is it. Last for a grain surpluses. Now we're dealing with a vermin problem. Maybe you can get cats? Not that I'm a cat, I mean. Oats. Jar of some sort of grain. Oats. I mean, Nico can't deny that that's just some sort of cat hybrid, though, I mean, right? Some kind of stew. not ready yet, but would you like some stew? I'm not hungry, but thank you. It's the least I can offer the savior. Alright, it's really interesting so far. I'm glad that we're actually like, interacting with, with people now. Instead of just robots. Most of the green moss covering our village has already lost its glow. If it wasn't for the thin strip on the boundaries of the land, people could easily fall into the ocean. Without light, Land and water become indistinguishable here. We're gonna get dizzy if we keep spinning around like that. I'm the tower, huh? Grandpa says the tower used to spin all the time, bringing sunlight to the world. I wanna see it too. Well, I'm here now. I guess it'll only be a matter of time again. Oh, the squares! Squares, man, they're bad news. Okay, it's nice that we're getting some more uh, news about that. Guess I can't enter that one. Dad is rolls very sick, but Jake can make it better again. Are you Jake? Uh, not really. I'm just a messiah, they said. I can talk with Jake, though. Wow, what's that like? Really cool. Hmm, come on, Nico. We gotta solve that computer puzzle together. Yeah, this game's like so depressing, though. I guess that's the charm to it, though. But at the time, our people used to live in these ruins. Due to flooding, most of us have moved to less permanent settlements. Flooding? Aye. The land has gotten brittle. The garden used to be in one piece, you know? And now it's just a bunch of islands that get smaller and smaller. Ah. like uh that wizard's like rams or whatever it's like that's like a side quest or something it's the best fishing spot i've found yet all the fish i catch here are longer longer than my arm well that's good is that chick who lost her kid or sister or whatever are you from the village no i don't remember why but our father left the village while we were so young We've lived in the ruins ever since. Well, it's just, well, it's just Alula and I now. I can't lose her too. Yeah, I, I'm gonna assume it's, it's that chick who lost her sister. I 
log on south. I need to find those rams for that guy. There's a robot here. Water sample collection in progress. Oh my gosh, again, I'm really sorry for the lag. This normally doesn't happen. I have like three videos exported now, which is not optimal. Station. Dr. Silver Point. No? What station? Oh, never mind. Research station. Okay. How come you're red instead of green? Well, more of a purple than red. But, you, but your eyes and stuff are red. I am only here to pick up this week's moth samples. I will return to my station in the city soon. I see. Cool. Okay, I'm gonna go, go to that building pretty soon here. I just want to see what's over here. Beep boop, water collection project resuming. Huh? Hello, in person. Hello. I've collected a duplicate water sample. Would you like it? Um, the program it says that organic beings need water to survive, so I shall offer it to you. Oh, uh, sure, we'll take it. Alright, I feel like that's important somehow, the tube of water. Monitoring abno uh, anomaly, yep, it's those squares again. What is that thing? An anomaly. Well, yeah, but... Yeah, so yeah, these anomalies are bad news as... Uh, as one of those villagers pointed out. Alright, let's over that research station. That seems a place of interest. Hello, person. This is the main generator of the Glen. Ooh. Jake and I actually fixed one of these earlier, and, and that plays across the ocean. This generator does not need to be fixed right now. Right. You guys already have power and all. A couple of fireflies are buzzing about in this jar. What if I take the power? Can I, can I do that? Generator. This one's got a working battery. Ow. I just got shocked. Oh my gosh, I had to figure out this stupid puzzle. Right with to get past uh, that uh, big dude there. Hello, person. Please know the ruins. Oh, it has a pressure point. Yada yada. Finds are gone though. Do yada go gives me access to new areas. No, actually no. Not theoretically, it practically confirms it. <gasps> yeah, they found the puzzle! 
I think, yeah. Yes. Oh, shit. How did I reset it? I assume that I would... All oh, these squares are here. What in the world is this thing in the doorway? It reminds me of what I saw a while ago at the cliffs. But for some reason, I'm afraid to touch it. Crap, do I have to leave the room for it to reset? Yeah, okay. So this is a puzzle. Man, Andrew is missing out, man. He'd be like flipping out saying, Oh, Jake, you found it. Oh, it's so cool. This puzzle's so cool. How the fuck do you do the one in the center? See, like over here? How the hell do you do that? Let me drag this and make us a little bit bigger, too. Like, how do you do that one? All right, let's do this one on the side. Wait. Wait, no, I know what to do. Yeah, okay, okay. Now I need the one in the center, fuck. Oh, it's giving me such a bitch. Or maybe not. You s oh wow, my... Okay, I've turned to normal then. You saved me! Thank you! I was trapped in there for so long. So, are you Alula? You knew my name? Wow, the Messiah really does know everything. So I just met your brother. Oh, brother. Brother earlier. Oh, right. Gosh, Columbus was so worried. Can you bring me to him? Wait a minute. How'd you know that I was the, um, Messiah? I didn't- I don't have the sun with me. Your eyes, huh? They remind me of the sun. Oh, well, I guess Andrew has something. Uh, Andrew, serious. I don't know. But, but the whole theme thing is prominent. Oh, that's why you're you're our, you're our messiah, right? Well, I a lot of people back in my home world have eyes like mine. Home world? Yeah, yeah. I'm actually from another world, you see. It's a place where the sun is in the sky, not in a tower. Do you like this world too? I, yeah, yay. Columbus keeps saying how this world is getting more dangerous by the minute. But that's okay. You're here now. You can make everything better. Yeah. All right, this chick's gonna follow me. I wanna go in here. See if there's any significance of the room she's trapped in. Guess not. All right. I wonder if the computer uh, is still turned on. I gotta find a computer room. You know what? I should, I should uh, in post production. I should probably edit. Uh, uh, Vector's clip in there with him saying that. Yep, yeah, that's what we really gotta do. We're on a mission to find the computer room. Actually, no, we're not. We have to turn, uh, what's her face? Uh, Alayla to, uh, Kalamas, actually. Oh, it's a bed. I can't sleep now, Jake. I need to get, to get Alula to her brother first. Oh, I see. So she can only sleep in like specially marked beds with that yellow square thing. That's really interesting. There's probably a significance to that. Anyways, where's that, uh, where's Calamus? Oh, here he is. Calamus! Alula! You're okay! Thank goodness. I was trapped inside the room and it was really scary. But then the Messiah saved me. Trapped in the ruins? Yeah, there was that weird stuff in the door. You know, the floating squares we see next to the ocean sometimes. Stuff you told me to stay away from? What? 
It's spread to the ruins now? This isn't good. Don't worry, I didn't touch it. I'm not hurt or anything. Still, if it gets any worse, we might have to find somewhere else to live. What is this square stuff exactly? Oh man, Andrew really is missing out on a lot. Bad. Anything that touches them just sort of gets messed up. Whenever you hear people say the world is decaying, that's what they meant. Obviously, you should avoid them too. I will. Anyway, uh, I can't thank you enough for rescuing my uh, for rescuing my sister's savior. Just call me Nico. Oh gosh, would it not be rude to call you by name? Huh? Why would it be? I mean, I'm just a kid like you guys. Uh, then, would you like to visit our house, Nico? Yeah, yes. Yay! Let's go! Oh shoot! Looks like we can't get past that block. Seriously? I'll be up ahead. I have literally never thought of that. You kind of get used to all the debris after living here for a while. <laughs> Come on, our house isn't far from here. Oh, nice cutscene action. <gasps> There's that diagram on the wall again! That's the same as the symbol that I put in in the front before. So, uh, welcome to our home. I know it's not much, but <laughs> feel free to make yourself comfortable. Ah, there it is. Here, we want you to have this. So, so like, uh, I want to take a look at her, her outfit for a minute there. Um, it's, um, I don't know. I mean, it's, well, I mean, yeah, obviously it's meant to resemble like a bird or whatever, but I don't know, like, I don't know if that's just for protection, or if it's, if, or if it's like, uh, this, this people's custom, or if it's like, or if they scavenge that, it's like, stay warm. Uh, my theory is number one, you know, two and three. Uh, it being their custom, and they wear those to keep warm, you know, since the sun's gone. Anyways, yeah, I get a quill. Oh, a feather! The edges are glowing yellow! It's a sacred feather from the Great Prophet. Oh? Yeah. She's this old lady her dad used to know. Her feathers can glow in the dark and she can see into the future. What? Or something like that. She gave one of her feathers to Father before she died. Father wanted to pass this down as an heirloom, although... It feels more fitting for you to have it. Uh, are you sure? I'm totally sure. I think that's what Father would have wanted. Thank you. Alright, nice. Alright, let's raid their shit. No, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Look, it looks like spoiled food. Oh no! I guess that's what happens if you leave your house for three days. Starts full of dried fish. It's a bed. Well, more like a mattress. The back room is full of dust and cobwebs. Okay, this is really interesting, like, I kinda wanna pause here as it's 3 in the morning, but I also do wanna continue just for a little bit if I can. Because, like, I don't wanna keep leaving Nico too much, cause she keeps growing more panicked every time I leave. Hey! I saw you go into the courtyard, so I thought I'd tag along. Same. Oh, okay. Yo, what's that thing in the water there? The ball. That's mine. It doesn't bounce around as much as it used to, though. Fish. Fish. I, mean, I don't know. They, they really do a great, great job making this world so depressing. It's sad, really. I mean, like, they don't have a son to live with. And they have to use... Oh, what's going on here? Oh, no. Oh, oh wow. There's here. Looks like it used to lead somewhere. Yeah, the sacred grounds. It's been a while since we went there. We don't have a way, uh, we won't have a way getting there now, remember? There isn't a boat, none of us can swim, and... You know, like, you'd think that, like, a society full of people would know how to swim, but, eh, Maybe just these two, who knows? What's the sacred ground? It's where our people are buried. Sometimes we go there to visit Mom. Well, her grave, anyway. Oh. 
Wait, how do you get there? I thought I said there's a boat. Oh, our friend helps us. He has some sort of machine that allows him to fly. I'm, I'm assuming that I'm assuming that that's an airplane. Sometimes he takes us along. Like I was about to say, we haven't seen him around for a while. I wonder when he'll come back. I wish that we I wish we, we could we could go see mom again. Come on now, Lula. Let's go back to the courtyard now. Okay. Alright then. Big building. Is that? Oh, I thought that animal hanging out of string was just that little sprite. Alright, let's go. Maybe I should have talked to them? Nice to meet you. Really, thanks for everything. Oh, are you leaving now? Good luck, Nico. We believe in you. Alright, I inspired some hope in those two people, those two kids, those two guys. Not quite sure what to refer to them as. Hello, person. Two children reside near here. Okay, I, I think I should go back to that computer. Well, no, not the computer, but, um, the robot standing guard to the refuge. I do want to visit that computer, though. Like, uh, yeah, here you go. Wow, not even a, you know, it's turned off prompt. Okay. I'm also kind of saying screw you to that guy in a slide stock. I mean, I looked down south, I didn't see any ram, so. Alright. So let's go back to that big robot. I found something to write with. You found something to write with? Yes, I have. The quill pen. Oh. Oh, come on. I know it's a feather, but you can use that as a quill. Tired from walking. Is, that, is it alright if I take a nap? Yeah, sure. I think we're gonna wrap it up here as well. Yeah, perfect. Perfect stopping point. Alright, well, this is part four, I think. Uh, it's a shame that Andrew couldn't take part. I know that, I mean, he he's gonna be really disappointed that he missed out on this part. Oh, well, it was always next time for him, I suppose. Anyways, see you later, folks. Like and subscribe if you enjoyed. 